Hello and welcome back to Kids Talk Health. I'm your host, Anna Meinhart. And I'm Ron Meinhart, her co-host, a.k.a. Dad. Today we're going to be talking about the importance of fresh air. Dad, is it just me or is it a little stuffy in here? You know, now that you mention it, I think you're right. I think we should learn more about the benefits of fresh air from our Kids Talk Health affiliate, Summer. Did you know that according to the EPA, indoor air is lots more polluted than outdoor air? Having a lot of dust or chemicals in the air can make our lungs very unhealthy. These are all reasons why we should allow fresh air into our homes. Besides being pure, outdoor air has lots more oxygen. It's also more vitalized, which means it has electrical charge that good for our bodies. Why is this so important? Because coronavirus not only can spread to the air, but it can damage our lungs. Wow, that was some great information that Summer had to share, wasn't it? Yeah, I'm looking forward to opening the windows when this podcast is over. I think that's a great idea. Oh, that reminds me of something I learned in Teacher Rob's class. Really? Let's check it out. Let's see what happens if a candle stops breathing. Did you know that candles need oxygen just like your lungs need oxygen? So what if we take this candle and we take it somewhere so that it can't breathe? So I'm going to close this candle inside and you watch. Now you're going to see very soon that this light has been burning up the oxygen and it's going to start to get smaller and smaller. It's going to have less and less energy because it's not breathing any fresh air. Very shortly, it will breathe its last breath and it's going to go up in smoke. There you see. I'm going to light the candle again and we're going to put it back in a place with no oxygen. But I brought some lungs for this, okay? So here it is, it's burning. We'll put it back into our sphere and you're going to see it wants to go out soon, but I have some lungs here. Now we're going to breathe with our balloon pump to make sure that that candle doesn't go out. Now you watch and see if you can see the container moving up and down. See it breathing? Okay, see, the light stays on when you keep pumping and your body will keep working well if you keep breathing well. So I'm gonna show you what happens when you breathe just a little bit with your lungs. Is that the full capacity of this balloon? No. All right, let's see how much energy the balloon has now that it took a deep breath. Wow, that shows the importance of oxygen. One of the gases found in our air. There's another air that's even more important than the air around us. You know what it is? What? It says in the book of Genesis that... God formed man of the dust of the ground and breathed into his nostrils the breath of life and man became a living soul. If we really want to be healthy, we need to have that same relationship with God and that's something that we can do just as easily as we can go open the window. Yes, and remember, you're never too little to help others. Until next time, kids talk health.